Well, let me tell you that my my lang my mother language is Spanish, so maybe we should speak in Spanish in order to uh, express myself better. So, even though my English is not bad. <laughs> Okay, who are you? Okay, well, I'm gonna try it in English, okay? Yeah, mix it up. Hi, my name is Eric Putzbach. I work in TV in the fashion industry for over 10 years. I, I got caught for TV when I was 24 for the big uh, Queer Eye for the Straight Guy. That's a TV show, maybe you know it from the ABC, no, what was it? NBC. Uh, B BBC, no, 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 uh, New ABC, ABC New York, yes, that's it. Well, the queer, who doesn't know it? The, the queer eye for the street guy, you know, the show, I was a fashion expert, so, and since then I've been working in TV, in Spain, mainly, in the fashion industry, and here I am. Hold this, because I'm I want to talk a little bit about the straight guy for a minute. Okay, you know the show? No, I don't. So talk me through it, because okay. um, the reason I'm asking, I'm one of the very few magazines that talk about the straight guy that versus the gay guy. Okay, because what? we're in 2015, oh, of and course. where's it gone wrong that men think, because you're wearing pink, I'm wearing pink, you know, you must be gay, or because you're mm. wearing well-dressed, oh, okay. you've got to be gay. It doesn't it's, mean, you know, no, and, and wearing pink or uh, being well-dressed doesn't mean at all. Nothing, gay. No, at or all. with your sexuality, but the industry has something to answer for it. So yes, how, do, how yes. do you answer this? Please, I mean, pink, pink color is a, such a masculine color. If you are really masculine, if you're a man, a straight man, and you really feel co um, confident about yourself, wear pink. That that's gonna make you so much more straight. Yeah. Really, and that's gonna attract women so much more. Oh, I spotted you before and I'm like, I want to kind of grab him and put him on the ground and I, I won't tell you what else was running in there. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's a, um, throughout your career, yes. what are your highlights, you know? My highlights, well, the, this Queer Eye for the Straight Guy was my, <laughs> my beginning in the TV industry. Uh, that was, my, I think, my biggest change yeah. in my life. But since then, I've been doing so many shows in Spain, always talking about fashion, uh, beauty, plastic surgery, because yeah, talk about even, that. Yeah. even if you can't see it in my face, I've done like 20, no, not 20, but maybe 15 um, little things on my face. Botox? Nose, ah. lips, uh, cheekbones, a little bit here, a little bit there. Why? Why? Because, you know, um, I think someone, if you've got the money, if you're um, strong enough to go into a, what's it, um, una um, kirofano. What's kirofano? Okay, surgery. Surgery, yeah. 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 Cosmetic surgery, yeah. Exactly. You do really well in English, by the way. You, you <laughs> should do it. You should definitely do it. Why should you leave, li live every day looking at yourself in a mirror and, and see something that you don't really like. Mm, I like Come that. on, yeah. surgery and in, and in this industry has evolved so much. Nowadays you can do everything you want. Yep. One question I've asked all the models today, the top models. Yes. Why do you think the best designers, fashion designers in the world are men? Tom Ford, Dolce Gabbana, mm. uh, Alexander McQueen. Why? No one can answer it yet. And they're all gay, right? Yes. Well, I, did, I, yeah. wasn't, I wasn't coming at that. Okay, I okay, okay, okay. No, but you know, it. gay men have a special sensibility right. towards fashion and towards t small details. I think only gay men can see that special thing. Oh. Although Armani, who's not gay, is also a big, big right. a designer, of course. But Valentino, Yves Saint Laurent, Christian Dior, the names you, yeah, you said yeah, right yeah. now, they're all gay. Because mm. I think we have this special sensibility that makes us special. Okay, um, is this real fur? Of course, I um, hate uh, fake hair. <laughs> um, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> the most controversial articles of my magazine is yeah. about Really? Fur. About fur. And I love real fur. I love fur. And they're fur. like, yeah, why? Why? You, you're an animal killer. <laughs> I, no, I, I didn't kill any animal. I gave so many people to eat with buying this fur coat yeah. so this this belongs to the industry talk about some tips because a lot on men's style fashion they're like I like the fur but I'm not sure how to put it together or oh my god fur yeah. is look I'm wearing this which is quite transparent oh, we're in winter oh. so it's quite, <laughs> quite 
quite cold we, outside. We can scan him in later. Just no, no, no. We can scan him in later. <laughs> Just keep it on. Keep going. Yeah. You know, it, and it's quite uh, cold outside. So it is. what better than wear some furs? Yep. There's nothing um, yeah. that, more uh, uh, abrigado. It is, yeah. Yeah, no, There's I nothing agree. warmer than wear furs yep, yep. in the winter. So that's why I'm wearing furs and because I love them. 2015, what are you up to this year? What's uh, in your career? What, oh my God. What are the highlights? What, what's coming? Can you tell us what's coming? Yes, I just shot a movie which is coming next May in Cannes, Festival Ooh, of Cannes. Right? Yeah, I'm very excited about that. Yeah, we are too. And I'm going to um, be shooting other two movies right. if everything goes right. Yep. Because you never know, it's a project by now. Oh. And well, maybe TV again. Yep. Because I've been doing a very fashion police. You know the fashion police. No, I'm loving fashion police. You don't know the show. No, the fashion I don't police? watch TV. It corrupts my creativity. Okay. Seriously. Yeah, maybe. Okay, I've, I've been one of the three fashion polices in Spain. Yeah. Right. Which means that I criticize, I analyze, and comment um, commentate, commentate. Yeah, I yeah. Commented about the stylism of uh, celebrities oh. worldwide. And it's uh, this oh is so god. fun. Mainly women or men or both? Men, women, everything. Oh my god! Yes, That's right. Yes, yes. Wow. So I'm like a fashion expert who analyzes and criticizes oh my god. what should be worn and what not. Okay. Is um, what are some key advice you could give to men about? Let's talk about the 18-year-old. He's graduated. Not sure where to start. What's some advice you could say to him? Because a lot of them are like, "Oh my God, I just I don't know." Well, fashion is so so big, and it enhances enhances. No, no, no. Yeah, it, enhances. It, yeah. No, como se dice que comprende mucho. Embracing a lot of. Como es? Embracing. Sí. Yes. Fashion embraces so much. You have so many um, uh, designers, yeah. brands, and, and styles. Okay. Where to choose yeah. from? So where should the 18-year-old go? Zara? Depending on what they feel, okay. what they want to express, what they're gonna do, where they're gonna go. Depending on what uh, social class they belong to. I mean, they have so many facts they should take into account right. in order to dress themselves. Okay. Three, three things that he should own in his wardrobe. Of course, uh, good jeans. Okay. Yeah. A good blazer. Yep. Blue. Mm, I'm feeling the blue. And good pair of shoes. Okay. That's the three must-have in every man's uh, wardrobe. Um, there's a lot of pressure I feel from you to succeed this year. How do you handle rejection? You know, when things are not quite going right. Oh. You know, what's your how do you handle that? Because I, I, I'm building a brand and sometimes I'm just sobbing and I'm like, just get up and get back in there. Okay, you know what? I've been working in this industry for over 10 years. What goes, uh, what goes on? Yeah. Perfect. What doesn't go on? Forget about it. Delete it. Yeah, delete it. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Oh. Not really. Life is so beautiful. Yep. Just enjoy your life, enjoy yourself and do whatever you feel without caring about what people say. Wear what you want to wear, wear pink, wear diamonds, whether you're straight or gay, who cares? It's your life, please live it. Oh, I love that. I I'm wearing so much black and just pink, my outfit, I wanted some, but, yeah, some shiny here. Oh, brilliant. A, a little detail. Okay, well. To shine. You. Oh, you are a spark. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much for thank your time you. and thank you for helping me build my brand. Okay. Yeah. It was brilliant. a pleasure. Yeah.